<laughs> but anyways, 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 is not important. Cause all you want to do is just, you know, tag me from, uh, you know, that, uh, that said I got turned on since that's the only thing you remember me for. But we're not gonna talk about that. I actually still find, I actually still have that. That's the only thing you remember me for, cause you're toxic. Just need to get the, just need to get the fuck out of here. Oh, shit, my. What just happened to my computer? Okay, there we go. We got, well, we got Cog, Sig, TBG, Armed and Ready, versus HMB, Viking, Tally Adequate, and FFO. This is gonna be interesting. Dude, stop posting that. <laughs> Amp, man, I mean, you gotta find something else to remind me of. I mean, we just played, we just played a good, I don't know, what, six hours today, and you've been, and you just trying to, and you've been toxic all day. You need to chill. Take a chill pill, man. Come on, man. Give, give my brother some love. I mean, come on now. You're more toxic than I am. I don't want to hear it, bro. I bet you money if I fly over you right if you if you probably spawn in right now if I fly over you right now you probably just gonna be all over. Um, you're probably just gonna be all over team killing somewhere. Amp, you were toxic. It's the it's the real deal. Only Puma. It's like we're missing people. Let's we'll see. Let's, let's do a crime. Sick Tech, Cop, TBG. I'm the race. So look like they slowly getting in here. We got TA Viking FFO H and B. Looks like one of HBs is here. We're slowly getting in here. So you know, it's uh, everybody's slowly trickling in. We're gonna, we're gonna give them, we're giving them a few minutes, I believe, and um, then we're gonna get this thing rolling. Look, both of y'all flipped the vehicle, okay? Both of y'all flipped the vehicle before. We ain't gonna talk about it. Got all these team killing going on. Easy. Hey. Uh, what's up, bro? What you doing? Chasing his logic. You going for a jog? Yeah, it's gonna be a lot. What it looks like. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. You can that do it. That got wheels. You can do it. You got it. You can do it. But real talk, guys. Real talk, guys. Uh, welcome to the stream. Welcome to Nick. The NAS 71. Well, we got the likes of Cog, Cog, Sig Tech, TBG, Armed and Ready, or AR versus Hold My Beer or H and B, Viking, Tagly Adequate, and Fight on the Fucking Objective FFO. Changing mass, we go live. We go live. See how this goes. We got 28. We got 28 to 38. Well, 27. Don't you can't include me. And we'll see how everything goes. Should be fun. Should be interesting. And and I'm gonna be probably spotting improvise from watching them die every five seconds because improvise sucks. Improvise, you're a piece of crap, man. You're toxic. You don't deserve to be here. GG. Yeah, he spotted. Don't worry. We we we, we watching him. If he tries to, if he tries to do anything funny, we we got him. We got him. Plus he's in TA. So if he tries to do any of that funny stuff, we got him locked. Oh, talking about TA. This the stream, the server is brought to by, brought to you by TA. Uh, locate lo to, to that uh, TA server located in Central United States. So thank you TA for bringing us the server. Not like I'm trying to hype us, hype my hype my hype my team, my clan up or my team up, but you know, you know. Thank you TA. You don't even speak English. English improvised. What's English? What's English? 
What's English? Huh? What's English? Uh, why isn't this moving? There we go. Falcon, you're, you're a stream sniper too. I don't want to hear that, man. All y'all stream snipers. Everybody in here is stream snipers. We're live on start. Live on start. Live on start. Why can't my thing? Oh, oh, what the fudge? All right, cool. Okay, I gotta wait till the game starts. That's right. All right. So like I said, we got FFO Viking, TA, and Force making two squads. I guess we got enough players to do that. Actually, I'm going to start on the U.S. side. TA talk. TA's being a little bit toxic today, so I'm going to start on the U.S. side. I'm going to do TA's T U.S. side uh, mics and see how it goes. I don't want to be on TA side. They toxic as hell. Are you, where are you putting your... Are you getting the fob down on him? Yeah, right. you guys want to take a transport and land uh, on one of the flicks? All right, place. look, improvise. Oh, if you're going to be doing that all game, we mean you're going to have problems, man. Lowercase squad names is real life, man. I'm just saying. Hey, that's how you do lowercase squad names, man. This is real talk, man. That's, that's, that's life, man. Life. Okay? I don't want to hear it. I do not want to hear it. I do not want to hear it. I do not want to hear it. If you're just going to say toxic all name, I'm gonna just going to ban you already. Just get out of my stream. Stop stream sniping anyways. You're not supposed to be doing it anyways. You guys want to drop me off the first cap? Who's you guys? 31. 28. Alright, so it looks like uh, we got two M-Raps. Both crows. We got Lodges. We got Transports. We got Striker. It looks like they only taking out their Lodges. Uh, this one. We're gonna call this US, it's only taking out a striker, an MRAP, and a Lodgy, and a transport. While we got a. Uh, By the way, uh, man. <laughs> uh, five just BTR two men, don't expect them to. Uh, and then we got Russians <laughs> taking out one Lodgy, a transport, and a 30 mil BTR held by Melon and Fox Chorus of HR, HSR. I can't read what's English. So, yeah, everybody knows if you play this map and you know you got an. Um, and you know you got a good amount of time into it, like me. I just got 2,200 hours today, so yay me. Look at that, uh, 22. I, I, I got no lie, 24 hours in the past two weeks, but uh, you know, whatever. But uh, yeah, everybody, if you know this map, everybody knows this fight's over hemp farm. Every single time, yeah, this fight's over hemp farm. Question is where the fight's going, guys. We watched the rollout going on from the U.S. and the Russians on the map. We got. Ah, uh, hey, don't judge me, Falcon. I used I love this game. We usually got a fob that usually goes into uh, what people call, Mum I believe it was Mummarines, or, yeah, I believe Mummarines or Fortis. And then we also got the fobs going into the west, over here in the west over here, or we got the sick, or we got the Sajanus Palace. So, you know, we you never know where the fob may go. Alright, so as you see, U.S. running in, Sick Tech leading, lead, Sick Tech leading the way along with, uh, TBG. Sick Tech Mills leading the way for Squad 1. As we got TBG Zulu with squ Squad 2, coming, Squad 3, my bad. So I already spotted the Lodgy. Marked. Drop the five, drop the half, U.S. is moving out. As we got the transport coming in from Sick Tech and HR, the first shot's been fired. Jedi Sandino, De Deputy Swan goes down first. Looks like Sick Tech's trying to go, trying to do the block. Let me block the road approach. Still up. He's still up looking around for the five. FFO goes ahead and goes and goes and drops in early. You no, know, it looks like Russia getting the advantage. Russia's getting the advantage on TBG right now at LTA. Going on as we go into the top, we got FFO coming in here. You got Milk. 
Mills up there taking another taking out Kiwi and Duncan back, but we still got FFO Kudu in the water. We got the Fob and Hab over here for FFO or the team wrestling. Hey, we're just like down, like down the rear up to the south. I'm pretty sure they, I'm pretty sure they see the Hab because it sticks out the wall. Wouldn't doubt it. Let's take a look on the map. Yeah, I don't think they this about it yet, but but in the creek, in the creek. No, it's in the creek. Roger. Well, that explains everything. Yeah, Kudu's just trying to hide up in the water. Damn, the creek, west of him. Renato sent him to the gladly. Ooh. Roger. Night, night. This half, this half's getting camped. I don't know what uh, that ADR was. Is down to our south side. We're clear of that. Well, looks like they did take out the BTR to the southwest over there. So, looks like they're going to be down a vehicle. As you got squad two of uh, Russia and Viking trying to move around Sir, the north side. What's that logic? We're south of our half. Are we worried about a flank from our rear? We engage, we looks like the U.S. took, away, we took over Saddam's palace. Sir, to go south. Damn, down over there. It looks like the only place that the Russian has to spawn right now has a forward point is the hab. Reg is taken out by a grenade. The Kagra and, and Matakora's Rex is just... They're just trying to get surrounded by the hab and they're going to eventually gonna push in. They tell me to pick the wing guard. There you do. The Caragua just... Then they just sprang into the cap. Look at the dead bodies from the Russian as U.S. has main control of pinpoint. Does Kog have his full squad? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, sir, they do. You got four people up in the half for the Russians. Well, five if you want to count the guy on the outside. As the cap's going in the U.S. favor. Talking about cap, though. Didn't make the marks, no. There you go. Yep, see, Cap's going in U.S. favor as of this time. But they're looking right into the hab, and they literally can't camp their hab. They just need to get people, U.S. just need to get people on it. I'm pretty sure the timer may be going up, I'm not too sure. I don't know why your name's up when I turn that thing off, but okay. Uh, I don't know what's up with the server skip, but, you know, there you go. Grenades been popping on, Kiwi gets taken out. They're trying to push up on the half now. Fourth Rider's the only one up, along with AOD. I don't know why these names are so big. Jack's gonna can stay alive, Jonathan's gonna hold down the point. We got Jack and Sam Squad up in there. TBG's pushing in, TBG Pizza chases out two people. And you got AOD still up alive. You got Peanut trying to push into the half. There's one more still alive called AOD, they're inside. AOD's still alive, AOD gets taken out and they dig down the half. The half is no longer in there. But yeah, they're getting shot from the outside. Vikings trying to push up into the half. But it will, it's gonna be a little bit too late or too late because they're on the hab. So let's, we gotta see what Russians got to do when they come out the hab. As no, they got nobody on Grape Farm. But yeah, they're pushed all the way up here looking up for this BTR as far too as Viking is. The U.S. takes over the hemp farm. But you still got Viking over here. They got a rally, but it looks like the shark is headed straight for it. Along with Viking trying to push into the hemp farm. But hemp farm, ooh. Looks like Keaton's trying to get that two-piece. He did get the two piece. They go night night over here. If I can go night night over here, as um, it, armed and ready are here in the striker. It looks like squad four uh, of the uh, Russian side is just still alive actually. Viking ten ten. What are you actually? You're a lat. Oh, do you not have a rocket? Oh, easy shot. Come on, come on. Don't let it get away from you. Don't let it get away from you. Don't let it get away from we you. We got a Lodgy on the north right here. Come on. Do you... Do, do, he missed. You... He missed. You're not being hurt. Okay. Don't panic. Make sure you don't overheat. Oh, oh, whoa, 
Okay, well, can Phoenix make this up? I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, I'm using some supplies. I got a 50 base on our west side. I'm done. I'm done. I can't. All right, let's go back. Uh, let's see, we got Russian guy people on grape farm. Let me actually do this real quick. Yeah, it doesn't be, okay, whatever. It'll be fine. Make sure you keep some, uh, keep the canary on our head. It's wide open right now from the... Oh, here. man. Enemy, enemy in a tree on that sniper mark over there. Over there. And now we got TA fighting over in the water over here. Looks like they got a rally out here, so they just fighting out in the water over here against TBG and the likes of Cog. TA versus TBG and Cog. Looks like TA's... Pretty much has a good advantage on that fight as Aunt Jemina's getting shot up by uh, maybe Fisher or Easy Red. As they all getting hurt over there, but Cox is laying down in here. Aunt Jemina is just... He looks like he took a GL and then made looks... Looks like from Fisher. Fisher's GLing the mess out of him over here. Cox too. Cox going down. The only person up over here is Guardian, but they still have a rally back here, so... Let's, let's actually take a look at what's going on around the map. Let's look on the map. We look on the map. We got an emplacement on hemp farm. Um, by Zula, TBG. Looks like they just spraying against the HSR. They actually got a good shot on the road. So they daring people to come up on the road. This BT, this 14.5 BT mark. Yeah, BTR is just holding there. As we got Jedi for TA as a squad lead over here. Looks like he's trying to get back to place another rally. How many pawns they got ref? They got six pawns left on the rally, but they just need a safe spot. But Cog's still alive over here. But TA's actually in a pinch as we got an MRAP moving by Rookie from Cog. He's trying to move out to the south. So as we look on the map, looks like uh looks like which looks like uh Russians are trying to play defensive. At this time, and TA is just in the middle of a sh of a shit zone. Honestly, TB between TBG and Cog, uh, getting sque squeezed in between. Another Buster looks like it's uh, looks like he's healing him. So he looks like a medic. So I do apologize that I fucked up on the scoreboard, but hey, it'd be alright. Uh, as we got, this is the fight we have going on right now. We got Squad Five, which is uh, armed and ready. Who is in the striker? The striker's no longer there no more, so looks like somebody um, may have got a rocket right to his rear end, even though you got lucky twice. You can't get lucky the third time. Third time's the charm, so night night on that striker. Like I say, you got Arnold Ready, cr Crimes, and uh, you got Sick Tech Keaton, Crazy Chick, and 78. One, I team killed somebody. Negative one, team kill. You maybe probably just, pop get just, get pop just may have went ahead. down, man, so it'll be all right. Score doesn't matter, it just matters the score at the end of the game. As you know, it's just 257 to 177 in favor of the United States. Looks like Cogs and TBG's gonna take to take out the squad for his rally over here. So CA no longer has a rally out here. And they still got Sick Tech coming out, or Cog coming out, and they take out Jedi. So TA's gone out there in the river right now. Only thing that's going on right now, we got, we got movement from the north, but armed and ready. We got. People in the east, but looks like that looks look how far everything's expanded. But looks like if you really think about, it, they got a small little arc right here, which they have good defense on. With rookie just with the lat, and, was that a lat? Yeah, it's with the lat inside the end map. So, just see how this plays out. Looks like Kudu got his own little dunk, own little play toy over here, along with Dunkerbeck. So they both got the little play toy over here, sitting on top of the roofs with their own little guns. Who is dropping the big gun and won't go for another big gun with his MG. Aiming at get Sick Tech Keaton as Sick Tech tries to make a move. They're all laying down. Ronald, Ronaldo's up there. Look, Perfect. 
Hundred percent. Yeah, we're gonna put down the snow on top of uh, the little two-story here. Awesome. Looks like it's gonna be a little stalemate going on here, but you do have. But you do have a little contact over here coming from Hog facing up against Disco Improvise and TA. I'll ho oh, some pl somebody please shoot. Some somebody please shoot Improvise. I right, I'll just watch Improvise for a second. I'll hope he. Do somebody please shoot him. Just shoot him. I'll hope he peeks right here. Hog shoots him right in the face. Uh, Cause I know it improvises stream sniping. As improvise takes out old man native, pushes around the building. As talk as improvise is, those nade that nade ain't gonna hit nobody night night. Let's go holding that corner right there, trying to go for Fender right now. Improvise looking across the way, looking for an Aunt Jemina. Aunt Jemima, if Disco takes out Fem Fender, Improvise looking towards nowhere. Nota Buster and uh, Ish is over there. At, but no, not, no one has contacts across the street. Just trying to hold his position. Guardian's just backing off. He's like, nah, man, y'all can have that fight. I ain't playing that, boo boo. But Guardian's going under the bridge. Nota Buster and Guardian may, be, may we run into each other. Looks like Guardian got contacted into another Buster. It changed to some shots into another Buster. Another Buster goes down for TA. Uh, let's look on the map, see what's going on still. Uh, let's see. Easy Red's trying to move up on Guardian, knowing, knowing that he hurt some shots. But he's looking at, he gets somebody across the street. I believe it was Aunt Jemima. Aunt Jemima, Mama. Jemima, Jemima, Mama. As Red's pulling and pushing up a guy across the bridge, it takes him out. Red's getting shot at. Um, I can't tell. Well, it doesn't matter. As you got Squad 5 trying to push in, I believe Squad 5 is armed and ready. Just trying to push in towards him, towards Great Farm. Correction. Yeah, Krems. Just being a, being a slithery snake. Walking right past Arch Angel. Calling right past Arch Angel. Arch Angel goes down. Grim's just trying to hide in this grass. Pretty, pretty accurate. No, Easy Red's not new to TA. He's actually been in for a couple months now. Actually. I'm trying to. We can clear our way down to uh, South Grim's. Good spot for a head down there on that mark. Grim's is like right there next by each other. He gets in the cross position. Night, night, star clips. One shot. Grim's still going out fourth rider. Missing all of both of them, missing a lot of shots. Cram's trying to push up towards Star Clips. Pulls out his pistol. Pistol whips, wiggles, night neck wiggles. And Cram's pushing back Good towards Fourth Rider. Fourth Rider's just waiting for him to come back around the wall. I just cleared you guys here. Fourth Rider's just waiting. He's just like, oh, you, did you jump the wall? Yeah, I believe he's bleeding too, so. Cram gets up with his pistol. Pistol whips, Fourth Rider. Going for another one, goes for Kiwi. Krems is just on a roll right now. LeBron to LA says Disco. Uh, if, if that is that confirmed? Is that confirmed? I I'm I'm wanna know. I wanna know. Clear guys here. I've been watching this. Hey, we'll get up mortars, I guess. Fuck. Krems is going off with that pistol. Pistol whipping everybody as a squad lead. I gotta go back to him. I'm sorry. I gotta give him some time. Krems going up against Scarface oh, no, next. Got, Scarface. Got right. okay. no, oh, Scarface said he ain't having that. Scarface has got to end his run. FFO. Scarface finally takes out Krems. What? Do I hear a toe? I heard a toe. As Scarface takes out Ronald. Ronaldo. They got a toe up here? Oh, we got the fob coming in. Oh, they got a toe all the way up top. We got Purple Lemon just using the toe missiles, like waiting for any BTR or anything to come in. As the only BTR that's believed that's out is right behind a MRAP? Time out. Time out, time out, time out. Time out, time out. Time out, time out. And wait. What? Y you didn't. 
Ricky, if you were smart, you won't shoot. Ricky had to reload anyways, but what? Were y'all even really... What? Hold on. So you're telling me... From right here... Hold on, take out the names. I, I don't know. I'm gonna leave that alone. Alright. Let me go back to over here. Squad 2 over here. Cog. Making a small little push. As you got squad 1 of US Mill Sig Tech trying to push up on the north side. Nobody's on that machine gun, but they are pushing up towards the north side and they got contact in front of them. You got Sandino and Ish is down, Smoke's actually. Down. So Sig Tech's just pushing up Smoke against his wall. Sandino has a chance to get a two piece. As, as they laying down over there. Oops. My button. Uh, there we go. You got Sandino versus Mills and uh, Nicaragua. See how this plays out. I don't understand why the name's popping up twice like that. But Mills slowly pushing up. Sandino actually got the line of sight on him. Mills is playing Slithery Snake over here. Icaragua is just hurt. Going back behind him. But Sigtex is getting a nice little push on this northern wall as Sandino shooting across the field. Mills is like, oh, you're busy, so I'm going to just give you time. And takes out Sandino, leaving this north side wide open for the United States. As no, as no, they got nobody on this north side. As most of them, most of everybody is over here in the middle between FFO Viking and HMB. Right now. I'll push straight to the east. Sigtex making a move over here to the northwest side. Mills doing work right now. Nobody's watching that north side, so they're coming right in through the north side. Ish goes out. I'm pretty sure Ish is just gonna run out, come around the wall, and get popped. Not gonna jinx it, but probably get popped by Peanut. We'll see what happens. It just comes out on the corner. He see he sees Mills run across. So he knows that there are people over there. They're trying to jump over the fucking wall. Mills and Peanut jump over the wall. It's comes right around the corner. Pops takes shots at both Mills and Peanut. They're Mills and Peanut moving into the half. Mills in the half. Peanut gets taken out by Mills with a grenade. <laughs> Sandino just falling in the half. Gets taken out by Mills. <laughs> oh, Mills is in the half. Fourth right is going to come try to clean up. So it's Ish. Ish takes out Mills. Or fourth right takes out one of the two. But the half is clear. Fucking great. Well, they got mortars. So if Johnny Omaha was here, he'd be like, mortars. Mortars. Whoa. Oh, okay. So you just got a 30 mil BTR actually sitting out here with pizza actually trying to drive in. That's the BTR right, actually be quiet. By the way, those are smoke mortars. You can, you can, you can I roll H. I'm sending. Oh. I'm, I'm doing chicken bacon. I'm, I'm hitting a smoke. Uh, I... Oh. Oh. That timing though. Pizza with the. Oh. God, purple with the timing on the 30 mil BTR. Oh, night, night. Good shot by Purple Lemon taking out the 30 mil BTR. Ooh, that was beautiful. Ooh, that was sexy. Night, night. <laughs> BTR go night, night. <laughs> oh shoot. Oh, this is great. This is going good. I'm loving this. I mean, the team count wise is 205 to 80, but. Overall, the match is a real good match right now. But like I said, oh, Cog actually did a flank back here. I'm wondering how they're, I'm wondering how Russ is going to retaliate. As you got FFL TA. Oh, I didn't even see this. Is this 6 No, that's TA. TA, Sam Squatch, AOD, and Easy Red. 
Looks like they're getting a fob down over here. They dropping the hab a little bit, a little bit away from the fob. Not a problem with that though, but it's, a, it's all good. As you got T A F F O. And six uh, tech's actually uh, inside the point, while T A and F O are actually outside. outside but you still got people spawning into the point. Cog moving in from the south. Takes now takes out Kiwi. Takes out Jet. Jet, I guess shots in the back. Silverman is taking out Cog. Silverman is taking out on side the point. Is Cog still moving up north? Seems like Melon takes out Slimmy and Keaton. The Out Patrol gets taken out also by Kiwi. We got Fender over here. Kudu's just looking on the wall. Fender gets taken out by Grenade. Kudu's got a guy right on the other wall. Looks like gun jumps right over the wall. Takes him out immediately. We got Cog over here. Cog gets taken out by Kudu. Three piece. Rack him up. Cog is taken out by FFO completely. I just got Aunt Jemima just sitting here on the wall over here on this over here. Uh, at, uh, I haven't been in this place forever. I don't even remember what this place is called anymore. But Vikings trying to move in on Aunt Jemima. Uh, trying to take him out as Aunt Jemima gets off the wall. Ten Ten sees Aunt Jemima going out the south door, so he's probably gonna call that out or either that or go and try to push him. Aunt Jemima's looking for Viking and HMV as Ten Ten comes out. Check out that flank over here that we got going on by TA. Aunt Jemima gets taken out by it looks like maybe Macho Madness, I believe. But as we go back over here, let's go back over here and look at this Might flank some, over uh, here. TA gets. It looks like they're coming in pretty heavy. TA gets taken out over here as you hear TBG calling back for help. <clears throat> F you got FFO Archangel. You got squad five actually. You got armed and ready. Uh do you actually have a rally this time? Yeah, you can actually put a rally you can, with two people you can actually put a rally this time. Last time he had the vehicle kit, so let's see what's going on. You got squad three, TBG Zulu Zula trying to push going to push up on Fisher. He's gonna push straight towards the top if he sees it. Fisher, Fisher misses this out on Zula. Zula's just on the wall. Fisher takes out Zula though. And she got Wave Manga. He actually retreats. Wave Mega, my bad correction. Uh, he actually retreats from that point. They know where the fob's at. They don't know where the hab's at though. That's the thing. So we'll see what goes on here. I mean, Squad 3 still does have a rally. Squad 3 from the other teams. Well, it's about the same squad. 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 Unless you guys are taking that Grape Farm point. So let's see. We'll just turtle at the hab in the run. I like the call on that one. But we'll see what happens. Sam Squatch is actually getting close to their hab. While Sig Tech is just keep pushing down. And Cog is actually standing side by side with each other. With Viking. Tenson takes out Fender. Macho Madness. Macho Madness takes out Aunt Jemima. Rally's still up on the wall out here though. So the Cog still has a chance to spawn in. As Sig Tech still keeps pushing around the north field towards Great Farm. I mean, going on my map. I want to see how close they be. Sig Tech, I mean, not Sig Tech, TA can get towards the fob. It looks like they're, they're trying to get close, but it sees what's going on here. They still got we need in. offensive support over here. Spawn everyone over here that's dying. Fucking TB, over here, bro. TBG's calling for it's major rough. support. Like, they're getting surrounded. As you got Improvised Camp in the southwest, you got Melon Camp in the northwest. You got, uh, who's this? Is camp in the northeast. And it looks like you got pretty much the rest of everybody TA over there. The, uh, a lot of TA over there, the camp in the southwest. So let's see what goes on here. South, As Sig Talk still, Sig Talk, Sig Tech still pushing in. But you have a lot of people from the Russian squad still available in Great Farm moving up to the north. North. I repeat, the north. See what goes on here. You can. Fourth rider with the two piece. Night night. You got Peanut and Sa Peanut and Sasquatch still outside the wall. Woot's still out here though. Woot knows they know it doesn't know exactly where with a sniper rifle. Woot. Woot's getting mad, so he knows he had to step in. Woot gets taken out by Peanut. As Flippy Nuts dies over there, I believe it's a disco eliminated, but wasn't paying that much attention, not gonna lie. Kong still got some rally still down there on the south. Oh, we got somebody actually inside of Hempo? Uh-oh. Who is that? That's Improvised and Ish are actually inside of Hempo. Imp's just, it's just rolling around. Gets taken out by Aunt Jemima. And, uh, yeah. 
TBG and Cog said, no, I'm not playing none of that. We're going to take you guys out right now, right now. So. That's uh, more accurate. They know where they have, so they know where they have that, and they know where the fob's at, so... My, my, curi my curious question is, uh, how's your ammo? Because if you got mortars, you might as well just mortar that point. You know where both of the halves are at. At Hemp Farm. Uh, Cog still has a rally up. Oh, no, that's not Cog. That's actually Viking. Viking from, from the Russian side still has a rally up down here. And it looks like Sigtex by themselves. They only got one spawn left in rally. Wait for squad lead, people. You had to wait for squad lead. Oh, they didn't wait for squad lead. They just said, forget it. We're taking it out. And, um... We're gonna burn it and we're gonna keep moving right along. So let me try and play Slippery Snake out here. Hmm. As you know, this ticket count is 148 to 43 in favor of the United States Army. As you got Squad 3 of TA actually trying to fight their way out. Mortars come down on that half. Over there to the southeast. Mortars coming down onto the half of um, Russia over here to the southeast. So let's see how well these mortars actually land. That's actually the better question. Woo! Went too far. They gonna land on Fisher? They gonna actually land on Apple? Ooh! Fisher go night night. Bob's inside of a building. Oh! There's a hole. That's loud. I do apologize. That is loud. But there is a hole right here. Well, if they can just keep hitting that hole, they can get the bomb back. Back out of here before I kill my ears. So, you know, the uh, Fisher goes night night. With a nice little more shot. Are those good mortars? I don't think they realize the fob's actually inside of that building. They should probably. Yeah, they should probably push, honestly, push towards the half. They know where the half's at. It's outside, so... Why are we mortaring the pop? That's my question. Which y'all know is inside of a building? I guess they think it's outside. I don't know. Negative. Get it. Mortars aren't literally hitting anybody, but you know, they're gonna keep mortaring. You got law out here going for AOD. Give me smoke mortars to attack over there on uh, grape one. Sigtex, looks like they're trying to push, still push out here. I don't, not too sh They still dying out here. You got Scarface, but I can't pretty much camp in their rally. Mark. That's the half? I think you need to redirect that mark. Oh, there he goes. Smoke, super And Dino's shooting a pizza across the river. He's just spamming shots over here. I'm not pretty sure he don't know where he's shooting at, but we'll see what happens. As the map begins to widen down, 135 to 31. I'm pretty sure Russians in the don't give up mode. We can make this close type of fight. Hmm. So they know where each other's fobs and habs are at. But um, one thing that I did really realize just now, you got Cog trying to push south. They're gonna put if they push right into this riverbed, they'll see the rally and take out this fob. But Sam Squatch over here, they'll scoot over here. They actually better. They playing slippery snake. Take out Guardian. They got guy across the street and uh, King Flippy Nips is trying to take shots over here. Looks like he takes out Sam Squatch. The medics are actually doing pretty good work, as you see. 48 revives going on for the United States Army. I wonder how well Cog's gonna play this out, because Cog is literally sneaking right behind them. He can go right on their fob. What's going on over here? Are y'all just holding hands, or do y'all really not see each other? Oh no, it's just taken out by Monkey. Okay. Alright, follow me. Maybe that's Monkey, or is that Money? Yeah, it's monkey, okay. And Cog can... They're going for the wide approach onto the hab, I believe. Maps begin to wind down. Russia's still, Russia's still trying to push on the hemp farm. Yeah, don't shoot from here. Heads down. Don't let them see you until we get the spread rally down. Okay. Cog's trying to get a new rally, get everybody together. to push up on the fob. Hey, we got, we got an enemy uh, fucking... 
ATR on this attack on this marker north of Grape Farm? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. I want to see if you got to shut off Tom. I gotta see this. Let's see if TBG try to tow missile that. Tebby one of cookies actually on it. But he's looking the wrong. Ooh. Yeah, so I'm gonna go back this way. I wanna see what Cog really does. I'm really kinda curious. Is they're gonna push. Coming in west, uh, west hat on the rifles close. 15, 15. The like file was out. marked earlier, so I'm kinda confused on why they're trying to push wide. They take out Fisher and Fourth Rider. Um. Okay, so well, you got two people over here, but they're getting taken. Looks like they're getting taken out by uh, who's this going to be? Impro Improvise. I'm not even gonna. No, he's not getting no time. Bye. Yep. Thank you very much, thanks, Junior. Push it, push it, shit. You got Kyle pushing in straight into the half. The half's really gonna camp from the outside. They're looking, they got an angle right into the half. They have everybody spawning in on this half, bitches are. <laughs> Log is taken out, Finnegan's taken out. This half is really, um. Ooh, Finnegan's still taking up a nade. The no more Silver Mega's taken out. It's just on the top of Native and, and, and Old Man Nate. Old Man Native and Silver Man. I can't even speak English right now. Which I'm kind of curious. They had a fob marked earlier. Why aren't they following up on that? Like, if this guardian comes right across the river, right into the, right up against this building, he's like, "Hey, I hear the fob," but I think it's too late. Anyways, um, dog, um, you're missing your Sorry, value. Oh. oh, I didn't realize. Take down hey. one sixteen to G -G. zero. GG goes in favor of the United good States job. Army. That's where it Good job, team. Go Better good job. Here. Don't hurt As we're looking at 48 kills, 48 revives, 51 revives, 174 to 156. Can I get a bonus? 226 down, down to 212 down. Yeah. So. yeah. How can a pizza? I said uh, TA, Evan Pro, and Viking got the work put out for them in the second round, 116 to 0. So we'll see what's going on. Um, What's going on over here? Like I said, I got screenshots of that. So I'm going to be uh, looking at that at the end of the game. So. We'll see what goes on over here, and we'll, as we move on to round number two, uh, I believe we're going to take a little break here. Not too sure how exactly they want to play this out. Uh, I don't want to listen to that. Let's put this put one of my jams right on. There you go. Oh, uh, yeah. So, it was a good... I'll say it was a good competitive round. Um, things flowed the way they should have. Saw two miss uh, rockets, but we're not gonna talk about that. We also saw a uh, tow missile do some work against that 30 mil.
All right, 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 all right. So, that first round, I still say it was a pretty good round. As you got. The teams of Sig Tech, Cog, T, to the B, Ray. to the G, and on and ready. Up 116. Compared to the second, going into the second round of Ness, 71. See how this goes? Will, will the team of the cup or the team of Viking HMB TA and FFO step up to the plate and knock this out of the park and beat them by 116 or more or will it go the other way around where Sig Tech Cog and TBJ plus on and ready take out take them out See what happens. We're going to, as we're going to Ryan on number two, uh, T of uh, NAS 71. Uh, a couple things, uh, let me go ahead and uh, tune this down a bit. Bam, there we go. Let's see what goes on here. It's gonna be actually an interesting, uh, I'm kind of curious as how this is gonna play out. As you see, FFO with the leader of Duncan Beck 10 10 and whoop. Coming seven it up to the plate as a squad leader. He wasn't squad leader in the last round, and I didn't notice that. So we'll see what happens with that. Be nice if I make a squad first, you know. I'm not. I'm not. I'm being special. Being so special right now. No, 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 bad driver. And I forgot to lock it. Um, I can back cap insurgent with, or mosque and insurgent go. with one yeah, of them. We got, we, we got progress. If you all want to do that. Okay. And then uh, I'll have my guys set up a uh, mortar, mortar fob on insurgent. We might have to wait on the fob, otherwise it could be a little close. Okay. Let's see what happens. They're just rolling out with two lodges and a transport. Looks like U.S. side, as we got the Russian side. Uh, let's see what they roll out with. Looks like, I already see a BTR in the process. So you got a BTR, you got a Logi, and a transport. So, let's see what happens. Oh my god. The spam! The spam! Let's look at this guy for now. Now look. Hoodoo, with the beautiful um, marks. Squad three, do you uh are you guys pushing the handbook guys? I don't got the admin broadcast one. Oh. Darn. It's alright. Uh oh. Whoop putting down his putting his foot down. <laughs> Look at everybody just like troll FFO. Uh, toxic, toxic. That's why Kudu is banned on our server. <laughs> Shots fired at Kudu from TBG. Oh, man. All right, let's see what this goes on. Let's see the rollouts. Oh, uh, I think we did you. No, we did them yes. Uh, so we're a little look at the US side this time. Let's see what we got going on here. We got one person right in the mosque. It looks like a medic. Nothing like the good back cappers. Wiggles hold it down, bro, bro. You got Woot and this transport who gets apparently stuck. I think y'all need to test your driving skills. I mean, I know I run into trees, but come on now. We got two lodges actually going to hemp farm. There's a transport and a MRAP. As the Sig Tech comes out with the lodge going up to the north side, they're probably going to end up putting their fob somewhere up here, more than likely. You've got TBG, put, got a full. Got a transport full of their team, of their squad going to south. 
And then you gotta, oh wait, no. Sigtas dropping that five a little bit early. Uh, run on Ronaldo's just like, I'm looking for a vehicle. I'm ready to take it out. You got on and ready. Uh, or no, yeah, you got on and ready in the BTR. You got Cog, Back Cabin, Orchard, and Grape Farm. I don't. PBG jumps out. On Saddam's Palace is what they call it. Bob puts okay, down. Take the back of if you need it. Bob put down Southeast of Hemp Farm as the both teams are starting to collide here. You got you still got the Crow and Rap by Ma Master Muffin and Jedi. Need to be careful with how you place that, honestly. See what goes on here. Buff actually taking shots. Takes out the transport. Rocket missed by Pizza. Muffin scooting up. Z Zulu. Zula. Takes him out. They got a fob and habit already built up on the west side of uh, Hemp Farm. Kind of push in. TBD's holding this outside. Melon gets the first shot. Zula goes down first. Um, Starkey is also getting shot. Uh, Rocket looks like may have missed the uh, M Rab. They only landed short. Monkey conspiracy, Monkey conspiracy doesn't miss it though. When he takes out the M Rab, M Rab down. TA and Evervo pushing up the um, Sedan's Palace while. Excuse my language on this, but we call this the penis. While everybody else is pushing up on penis. Uh, two of them, two of six takers taken out. Starkey's alone up in the Sedan's Palace gets taken out. Sedan's Palace is all FFOs and HSR plus. Uh, outside TA ish, you still got Sig Tech and Peanut coming up on the west side of Hemp Farm, northwest side of Hemp Farm. You guys, Mills running down over Torquisha trying to push up on the north side of, uh, of, uh, Hemp Farm. There you go, I can't get the words out. And she got the 30 mil BTR also pushing the back side of Mills and Ronaldo. Vikings still pushing up on the north side trying to hold off of Sig Tech, firing across. They're both of us trying to shoot up north. As CBG still got some rally down to the southwest over there on the end over there. DC Red FFO is trying to push him. And FFO Archangel and Melon and uh, Sam Squash trying to push to the west. Melon gets taken out on the roof. Kyle gets taken out while trying to push up. Boots up. Look, look, look like he's on fire right now. Looks like he could be able to take everybody out. As TBG still keeps trying to push in to try to take out Woot and FFO Fourth Rider. As if you look up north, we got Mills going up, trying to just going going off up there. As Viking keeps in taking out Disco Lemonade. Looks like Sandals trying to stay alive. He's trying to check out anybody. Takes out Icaragua. Ronaldo's looking for a Disco. Ronaldo takes out Disco. And Big Worm is taking out North Side. Goes to Sick Tech right now. So Sick Tech may need. Viking needs some help North. Viking needs help on the North okay. Side. They still got a rally to push out. Another bus is going to go help them out over there. It just looks like he gets a try to, tries to fire a lat at uh, the 30 mil BTR. But misses. Is Ish rocking that uh, hat kit like he usually does? Yes, he is. So Ish is ready for that. As a TA, uh, Sam Squash, Easy Red, and, and, and Fox, Fox Cross, I probably fucked that up, was trying to push onto the west side out to Pizza. <clears throat> TBG, Sam Squash still pushing TBG, and probably trying to, it looks like he might push the rally. As Wu's still trying to hold this riverbank over there to the north. Wu gets taken out by 71 of Cookie. Arch Angle still pushes up to the west. Sam Squash taking out by anything behind that, behind that transport, knowing that there's people there. As Fox Cross is trying to look down the croc, trying to cross Sam Squash and Easy Red, trying to get them a little lower range. Sam Squash is still pushing the rally as Cog Superman trying to push out behind Monkey Cross, Monkey Chris, and try to put fires on Rocket right into Saddam's Palace and nobody's still alive. Sam Squash takes out the rally at TBG. Sam Squash also takes out Starkey. Starkey gets taken out, so the other guys Cog TBG and uh, Cog, Cog Superman and Monkey Conspiracy still in what they find Rockets at Saddam's Palace. Nobody's there, nothing's hitting. Sam Squash is still need to watch the south. Easter Red needs to watch to itself. <laughs> uh, Fox Cross needs to get the cross, actually get the cross. Sam Squash trying to look on the riverbed, trying to take a conspiracy. Okay, so Monkey Conspiracy gets taken out by Sam Squash. Superman trying to push up on uh, Saddam's Palace. As we go into the north side over here, we got Sick Tech actually getting a good, nice little, good, nice little push over here to the northeast side of Hemp Farm. Oh my gosh, I'm. Who never thought thought this guy? <laughs> As you still got the 30 mil BTR actually uh, still out to the northwest of Hemp Farm. So you got a nice little. We got a nice little contest going on the hemp farm right now, but main control goes to the United States of America from FFO, TA, and Viking, and a little bit of H and B help. Easy Red and Sam Squad is looking like they're trying to push onto the fob that Sig Tech put down over there to the west on the riverbed. Archangel's pushing up. Easy Red's pushing up. We got. We got sli yeah. slithery snakes going on here. Old dude's trying to take out Archangel. Archangel don't, got, don't really got an ang angle on him. Fox Cross is going to try to take out 
Keep it to the north of him. But he gets taken out by Rookie. Rookie, Rookie takes him out. Takes out Fox Cross and Sam Scott. Two piece. Uh, I don't need Night Night. But you still got Six Tech still trying to push off on the north along with spot one on one. So Viking and FFL Melon looks like they're trying to hold off this put north push. Uh, Mills puts this rally a little bit close to Viking. If Viking can actually get up and take that rally, they can be good off. But it looks like it's going in favor of FFO and Viking right now. If FFO no longer takes out Medicus and Viking actually moves, they can actually take out that rally easily. Yeah, somebody just spawned a rally. I can't see the name because there's so many people. I believe that's Torkisha. Torkisha uh, is still alive over here. That's Falcon watches bro watch his brothers in arms. Sick Tech trying to push up. Lag comes in from Cordanza. Misses, doesn't hit anything. Got Torquisha takes out 10 10 from Viking. Star Clips. Right Star Clips looks like he's trying to push up into the rally. He can probably take out that rally, and that'll be it for the Sick Tech. Star Clips is just on the other side of the wall of Torquisha, so. Um, little stalemate. Cordanza's trying to push out too. Try if he can get close to the rally, that rally's gone. And Mil Mills and then no longer have a push. You still got Torticia. Cordanza got eyes on Cortesia, takes out Cortesia, and there goes and there goes Sick Tech's move. So north side go belongs Just to the United States Army. With nobody alive over there. So now but the one thing I did here overcome is that they found the fog. And they marked I believe they marked it, but you can't tell over those red bodies. As you got Jedi got into that hab, but it gets taken out right, as still up. So that hab is still up. So question right, is I'm, uh, I'm gonna have my guys sit on uh sit on the point. Viking seems like gonna be holding on him farm while FFO and TA could have pushed out towards the west side of him farm. Alright, sounds good. Falcon, I've done them before. There's nothing new to me. <laughs> we have a second Lodgy on Squad One's rally that could be used for supplies. Okay, we'll do. One thing that could be troublesome is that there's nobody on Great Farm, so... Mm. The only thing that's got it on is got a wall right here for for Russia that can hold them off. So, but they still, like Woot said, they still got a, a Lodgy right here on this west side over here on Squad 1's rally, who's Woot's rally right here, so... They may be able to flank and do some work if they actually, actually give it a try and push. And, um... I, I'm going to have to get away from the action as everybody's pushing this river over here. John, I need to see what squad one on the other team, Zula, is doing over here. DBG, as they just sitting on Grape Farm. Starting to get contact south in the river. Building emplacements. Tow missiles. Mortars. Mortars going to come in from purple in a second. 30 mil BTR. Deputy Swan's running Lodgy back and forth. So TPG actually has people pushing them. They're... That's how that guy's supposed to do it. Just keep the amount of people that you need back, back, but have you know, the rest of the squad push forward. So that's exactly what they did. And that's exactly what they're doing. It seems to be working out for them as you got like pretty much the whole team spawning on this fob and hab. So <clears throat> question is, how's FFO, Viking, and TA going to be able to take out this hab with the whole team spawning here? And she got squad three, Cobb trying to push out towards the south side, towards the Dom's palace. But it looks like the only person alive over here is Fender and uh, Silverman. Fender takes out, uh, it looks like maybe Easy Red, Easy Red, and Nutter Buster. Fender's dead. She still got Old Man Nader. Looks like Cox trying to push to the south side over here, trying to get control of it. Wu, on the other hand, is looking like he's looking in the south, knowing that people cross the river. So, they got that going on. Wu's still looking south. Wu's gonna get pushed by Superman in a second, trying to push across the river. Getting Cog, uh, Guardian over there, but Wu's still got people. I don't think those are friendly mortars. I'm getting to up now. Oh, okay. Superman takes out Wu. Got the sneaky slithery snake going on over here. Is that hat mark still out here? Yes. Um, okay. Mortars are actually inbound. Those aren't friendly mortars, because it looks like nobody... The only thing that got more is, is Russia right now. So they, those are pretty good mortars trying to hold them off. Like I said, they're holding off this fob very well. To the point that no one, they can't get a push. Viking's still controlling the north side along with TA Nighthawk. Oh, sorry, so, on the good oh no, Nighthawk's down. 
Don't these names. Squad three, repeat that, please. That's our ring with squad. So it we looks like we're gonna have a little. Remember, it's not just ours. Oh, we do got more that's going on here. Viking, um, uh, Buster well, Cherry's uh, getting some more. Let me hold it head. Let's take a look at the kills. We got 65 for the U.S. and 53 for the Russian. Right hmm. 11 revives, 12 revives. Down 82 to 69. Going in favor of the United How States. Yeah, we may get killed. They may be getting the kills, but positioning wise and making the plays, they. Russia are holding strong. Can you repeat that, please? Mortars are generally good, and you just walk around. Roger. The mortars are lighting them up over here, so. Yeah. Every time I think of mortars, I think of uh, that mortar farm that uh, Momo Rains be doing, so. Yeah. Question is, where are the, where are each other more than later? I can't tell who's who's because I'm pretty sure Vikings trying to hit the hab and fob, while while TBG is trying to hit to the west side of. Well, they took out the Lodgy. Those get taken out instantly. Okay, so TBG is firing smoke down the river a bit, so this is looking out well for them. But looks like Rush is trying to do a push back. They're also getting the north side, also. So we got a little fight going on here. It's gonna be, it's gonna be the matter of who controls what. They're on their fob. Cog, Cogs found their fob. They know that where their fob's at. <coughs> Superman and Aunt Jemima are actually sitting outside the fob. What's next in here? I'm not sure they can hear it. Cause I can't hear it. They know where it's at. They see the they see the logic, so they know where it's at. As Woosh is sitting inside the hab, coming about to come out, looking in the window. Aunt Jemima no found spot him, jumps through the freaking window, kills Woosh in the back. Cog actually one Cog's actually in the hab. Who's the closest person in the hab? It would be Viking over here of Ten Ten. Aunt your mama's by himself over here in the half, but along with Superman, Superman's gonna be pushing. Aunt your mama's playing smart because he knows that everybody that spawns looks east. So the question is, how long? They're digging it down now. Oh no, they're going for the fob. They're straight going for the fob. They said forget the half. They're straight going for the fob. Nighthawk's running as fast as he can. Jemima got some eyes on the door. Big Worm spawns in. Big Worm gets taken out by Nighthawk. Big Worm has to put us in. You got Superman left. Superman gets taken out also. So. Oh, and it's team killed by Big Worm. Oh, uh, well, they clear the half, so that's all that matters. But the, but the problem that the United States Army is going to have is that the fact that they're getting pushed from the north, and they don't know it. Six Tech's pushing from the north. And they don't know. Oh, wait, wait. I missed something. Their fob's going down over here also, but um Squad three That was my fault. People still alive up in the half, so they rebuilt the half instantly and the halves straight back up. They were getting they got into the half, so it was it was only the half or half trade. And then they think they slick about this. Good mark on the 30 mil, and then you also got TBG trying to build a back fob so they can flank him, but Zig Tech's out here by themselves. No rally or anything. They just running in. They'll be able to get into the point. Big one moving the logic. That's pretty smart. Like I said, TBG is getting set up. They can pretty much get set up from. They use that file for Mosque and Insurgent Checkpoint, but more than likely Mosque. They're going to need to set a rally. Uh, with that logic driving by, I'm wondering if, Ron if Renato or Slimmy either shot at it or Big One maybe saw them because. That may give away a lot of sense. We got a big battle going on here. Icaragua might. Madocus Rex gets taken out. Icaragua is still pushing up in the wall. Torquisha getting pushed out. Torquisha and Tenten go down. I mean, Archangel and Tenten go down. Icaragua takes out Macho Madness from HMB. Torquisha looking across the way, looking at Improvise. Improvise goes night night.
Renato's still out there. Takes out Star Clips. Still peeking. But he gets taken out by Jet. And he's still got three people on this north side. Begging people to come out this north side. They they have full, full control from the north side. The Russian, they as in Russia, has full control from the north side. And the Logi... It looks like this marker got taken out for the Logi because of the fact that they had a rally on this Logi. So they know that people are coming behind. So we got... They're getting a nice... Russia's getting a nice little surround on um on everybody right now, but the question is, like, how's the kills gonna be? And will they be able to push out? That's the better question, actually. Because if you think, if you look at it, there's only one rally for the U.S. and that's Duncan Beck's, which he only has two, as everybody else okay, does not have a rally. So rallies are big in this game right now. I'm just gonna point that out. Rallies are big in this game. Have as well. They're getting pinched like it's nothing, and they don't. The mortars aren't even coming and getting anymore. Yeah, mortars aren't even coming in. They're not even at the mortars anymore. They just say, "Forget that." They're. I'm going right into everybody. Nice. Right, so you got TBG and Carl pushing through this field over here, getting taken out though. There goes Auntie Mama Starkey and Sebi want a cookie. Old dude gets taken out. Zula's next. Up on the wall. Improvise. Ask him for people to save him. Fuck him. You better just leave him on the wall. Zula goes taken out. Nice. Zula. Zula. Oh. Well, they get... Got, they got pushed out to the east. They just don't know that they got a fob all the way out here. And she got um Viking and TA and FFO and... Every, pretty much everybody, every, one of everybody on the, uh, on the American team. Looking north, trying to stop this push that's coming along. They know they're going to come from the west. I think it counts 209 to 176 in favor of the United States Army. But as you remember, the United States Army is up 116 to z 116. So, and here comes mortars I just heard from Orchard. So, wondering where the mortars are going to land. More than likely they're going to land either hemp farm or on the half. So, Gonna be curiosity. And they come in. They're landing right on mortars. Looks like first one takes out Wiggles. Wiggles go 9 9 by the mortars. They're spraying them all over him for him. Did I just take out the mortars? The mortar landed on the mortars, so more them. You know, since mortars are down. Pushing on the north side, but they uh, they're spotted by TA. So enemy have has been spotted southeast, so they know they got a have out here. And Nighthawk's gonna be pushing them out, pushing back towards him, trying to get the have. But Nighthawk is taken. Looks like he gets taken out by maybe by old dude. He may be old, but he still know how to shoot. So that's all that matters. As you got squad three FFO. Trying to push them, trying to push back on the south side against Cog. Looks like they're getting a straight trade fight right now. Laws hanging, hanging behind the blown up transport. I hear a striker coming in. Striker comes in from T, from Tally Adequate Ish. Ricky gets taken out. I'm pretty sure they know that they got a striker coming in. It's just trying to help FFO out. As Guardian with his big gun, as Guardian with his guns just sitting in front of the striker, it's just not know that he's out there. It's just taking shots at Fender. This may be a, this this striker actually may be a game changer. Like that. Oh, never mind. They got a rocket right up his butt. And I believe that's from Old Man Native, and there goes the rocket. Where did that rocket? Like, who fired that rocket? Wait. No, seriously, who fired that rocket? Oh, it's Aunt Jemima. Fire that rocket right up, to, right up Ish's that eye hole. So that strike goes down one hit in the butt. As you look around, you notice Sig Tech 
Sneaky little sick tech. Falcon's, Falcon's team over out here is out there to the northeast. Just trying to sneak by, but um, I believe Disco sees them. Yeah, Disco's taking shots at them. Takes out Mills. Knows there's a squad to the northeast. Wondering if he called him out. There's just attack markers everywhere. Holy snap. As you got uh, people trying to push out to this pop over here. But uh, they didn't make it. That would be Easy Red and Cordonzo to get taken out. But it looks like Old Dude. Old Dude's making some big plays. I may not be casting him, but he's making some big plays. Every single time that I come around. Holding off that half. Buster Cherry uh, looking north. Trying to kill anybody that's coming around that wall. That's what should be Slimmy right now. So we got Sig Tech still trying to make a flank and spank, but it's not working out that way. Whoa, big move, big move, big move, big move. Squad 1's pushing into the half. Squad 1's whoop, it's in the half with Archangel. Come the fuck on, man. I thought you were going for Archangel, that. Archangel gets tagged. Actually gets attacked up by whoop. They're in the half. BTR, BTR trying to shoot up the half. What is going on? They spawn on top of the half. Oh, crazy chicken with the team kill. When people spawning on top of the half, Wu doesn't know. Banishing inside the half. Anjumama and Peanut spawning the half. Wu good pistoling with the with inside the half. Peanut's in the half. Peanut gets taken out. Uh, I'm not sure if Peanut gets taken out by the Mortar or Wu, but he's dead. Uh, Mortar's landing. She probably pretty much team killing everybody on the half. Um, that was a great push. Mortar's game man, but I, I think. I think they need to calm down with the mortars. I think purple's getting too mortar happy. I'm honestly still wondering why we haven't seen a push to Great Farm. Wait, yeah, that's where purple. Do you, uh, where do you guys see mortar? Uh, getting those half markers. Got wiped off. Okay, cool. I, I'm still wondering why we haven't seen a good push I, to Great Farm yet. Everybody's pushing towards this half over here. I know this half's a big deal, but they have nobody on Great Farm. You can literally sneak around to the south side. I mean, there's so many things going on here. We got this push going back into the fob. You got th you got this right here, which with Master Muffin and Sandino trying to push their half over here to the southeast. You got 6 XL trying to make a move around here, but I think they died over here. So... so there's so many things going on, I don't know what to watch. Melon's trying to push towards the half again. As Omnium Ready is still trying to push with the with the 30 mil BTR that's been staying alive the whole game. 160, 161 to 125. Melon doesn't even know this. People too straight to his north. Fires a rocket at the 30 mil BTR. That's gonna take more than one rocket if you hit it from right there. Oh man, these mortars are mad. One is loud. Bow Patrol gets taken out by Kiwi. Oh, I'm trying to push the south side over here. It's like they're all holding the line so they can just hold the spot. Do, uh, do PC Gaming, thank you for the bits, by the way. I, I turned my bits off for this particular stream. Looks like this fob may get taken out. Looks like they're pushing into the half. Ish is pushing into the half. Nighthawk pushing the half. Tandino pushing around the half. Sarka is pushing the half. Ish is taking the half. And also, Master Muffin is in the half. That's a muffin taken take out. He has to reload. He has to reload. He takes out one. Oh my god. Master Muffin knows there's one right there. And he takes him out too. Oh. Oh. I need a patch. Someone to patch me. I got you. I'm a medic. I'm a medic. I got you. Where do you want this motor? Now they just gotta, they gotta find the rally though. The, I mean, not the rally, but the fob. Right, the fob's in the south. And all my guys hit it. I'm <laughs> Master Muffin with his clutch plays on this ab over here to take it out. And all they gotta do is just find the fob, which is south of them. But the question is, will they be able to find it? He's playing hide and seek with them, pretty much with the radio right now. So as we go back over here, uh, they're trying. We got mortars coming in. 
from Viking and Mortis also coming in from TBG. Sam Squad's got close to the half again. Everybody's getting close to the half, but they just can't pick it out. Looks like they finally found the fall to the south and in the southeast of Hemp Farm, and they're taking it out right now. So there goes 20 tickets right there um, from the Russian side. So you got 87 to 151. Once again, Can I this Russian the, side uh, is cards? up by 116 tickets. 116 Roger. tickets. So. You're about to get hit from the northwest as well, working. This is gonna be a, like I said, like I said before, this is a team deathmatch. Who can kill who for, oh. 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 I'm not sure they're just going for the mortars or they're actually trying to push that to the great one, but oh. Let's see how, I wonder, I wonder how that's gonna pan out, but. I'm not sure this is gonna be well because they're gonna need the bodies on hemp farm. That's the scary part. Because uh um, Sig Tech's still trying to wrap around to the north, but they're pushing in a little bit. And they're getting closer and closer with FFO trying to hold them off. We got Vikings still trying to hold them off with mortars and tow missiles and stuff. So they dig it, they tow missile up. Oh, oh tow missile versus tow missile. <laughs> Fourth rider, fourth rider gets fucked by a tow missile. Oh, oh, who was on that on the toe? I gotta see who's down on the toe. That was a beautiful toe. That was monkey conspiracy. No, yeah, it was monkey conspiracy. That was a beautiful toe. Toe versus toe. That was beautiful. Ta is pushing in the grape farm from the west. TA is pushing Grape Farm. TA is pushing Grape Farm from the west, southwest, sneaking in there. So, like I said, you got nobody on Grape Farm. They got a repair station all the way out here. That's it. But they got nobody actually, nobody's actually on Grape Farm. And I'm not sure how much build points this has, but it's not going to be enough to hold off this, this, uh, 30 mil BTR, which can, which... TA can probably take out. They got a lot. I'm, I'm kind of curious if they got a lot. Yeah, it's Sam Squash who has the hack it. Sam Squash is actually up there. Huh. Sam? Sam? He's waiting for it to come by. It's not coming by him. Omni Reddy's going around the northwest side, taking it safe because he, they may have a feeling something's out there to the northwest. Out of curiosity, but it looks like a uh, FFO Viking are actually holding them off. Plus, a little, little bit of TA are actually holding them off. But we got Cog still pushing up from the south into Don's Palace. TA's pushing Great Farm uncontested. Let me repeat that uncontested. And if they get that point, if I'm correct, they lose Russell loses 20 tickets. So that means they're going to be down to about 49 tickets today, about this time. And as Wiggles gets a team kill, U.S. doesn't need this. This is going to be a scary match about how this ends. Um, and the question is, is T.A.? Oh, somebody got shot up by T.A. Oh, Where's that Sam's bar? So, question is, are they neutralizing? Let me pull my stuff up that I supposed to then have up. There we go. They're neutralizing. Nobody knows that the Great Farm is getting neutralized. Nobody knows that Great Farm is getting neutralized. Nobody's around that point. Great Farm is all theirs. So my question, t my question is, as a TA, as TA is just like going on a ha going on a rampage down here, about to take out the TBG's rally. Sort of tell they know they're down there now. They know they're down there now. TBG's rally goes down. So they know they're down there now. So here's the here's the dilemma. Here's here's where we're at right now. Okay. So TA has Great Farm uncontested. Halfway neutral. Which they're halfway neutral, as we just said. They get 20 tickets, so it goes down to 44. 
if somehow Sam Squatch can actually take out this BTR. If Sam if somehow Sam Squatch can take out that BTR, they'll be down to close to 20 tickets. Which will be a which it's a big swing. So GBG's running back towards Grape Farm knowing that they're on it. As they save, as TA saves the rally. Is that Sam Squatch? And they put the actual rally inside of Great Farm. Ooh. We got a neutralization, guys. We have a neutralization. One, one Lodgy down there and one Lodgy at main. So they can grab a Lodgy and actually move out to Great Farm. They can get a problem to have on Great Farm. Um, yeah. There I was like, Sam, I... Sam, with the hat kit, actually can get the BT 30 mil BTR. I'm not sure if the 30 mil BTR is where that they're actually inside a great farm. Sam can actually get a good shot onto that and actually take him out. This is scary because Sam has the hat kit. This could be a 40 ticket swing. FFO, you have uh, I see your six o'clock. I'm the ready's backing up. I'm like, nah, I'm gonna want to that. Captain Grape, if you guys can get here. Might need a fob up though. TA is about to get pushed from the west uh, and the we're east. Kind of in the middle of shooting people. What they need to do is grab that logic from main uh, and Sam and misses the rocket. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. 30 mils popping into Great Farm. Mm hmm. We we'll tried to get on the roof and yeah, it didn't make it that far. Ooh. Okay, so here's the thing. They can get a if they get a fob down and a hab down onto Great Farm, they'll be in a great position. What question is I'm wondering about this because they're not pushing off. If Russia pushes off onto Great Farm now, they can hold. They can take them off of Great Farm and get it back. It's, as you see, it's one nineteen forty four. Remember, remember, they got to win by. All right, I think we uh, one hundred and sixteen tickets. So. Yeah, move up, move up. We got it. It's one thirty eight to one four. Oh, one thirty eight to four. Oh, this is a big swing. This game may be over and T. <laughs> Oh my god, the tap great farm! This one thirty-eight to four! Oh, I did my calculations wrong! Oh! Oh, this is a, oh, this is a feel bad man moment. Oh my gosh. One thirty-eight to three! Oh, this is a feel bad man moment. Oh! Oh! One thirty-seven to three! Oh, this is a Phil's bad man moment. Their rally, TA's rally just got taken out. So, people can't give up right now, as I believe. No, they're not. They're not neutralizing. Oh. Oh. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be. Good game. Yeah. So that's what happens like when you actually rich. try. Oh Woo! my god. You've got to yeah. be kidding me. What a swing. No nature walks equal victory. <laughs> what a swing. I forgot to get tickets back too. So oh my gosh. What a swing that was. What a <laughs> Holy snaps. What a win. <laughs> What a swing. I can't say nothing to that. That was one hell of a swing. That, oh. Oh. That was a swing. Improvise, you're not important, so I didn't watch you. I just watched the whole game, but that was a... That cap at the end of the game, the cap great farm, was one hell of a swing. That's all I could say. That cap at the end of Great Farm literally won them the game, and that was one hell of a swing.
Oops. Ooh. I, I just don't know what to say. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm stunned. I'm not going to lie. That was one hell of a swing. All I can say is thank you, thank all the clans for coming out to, for another game in North America squad. It's great to see all these clans back out here, but that was one hell of a swing. That was one hell of a swing at the end of the game, just to just to make sure they won that game. That flank by TA to get onto the point and then hold them off just to cap the point because nobody was actually on the point was a one hell of a swing. That was amazing. That was amazing. I want. Whew. Well, once again, guys, thank you, thanks, thank TA for um, hosting the server for the North American Squad seventy one. It was really appreciated. Thank them. Thank Woo. Woo, what a, what a server! I hope everybody enjoyed themselves and had a good time over here. Um, I, I'm so shocked. Like they did the flank and spank. They hit him with the flank and spank. They hit them with the flank and spank. That's all I can say. They hit them with the flank and spank. So I want to say thank you, Cog, Sick Tech, TBG, Armed and Ready, HMB, Viking, TA, and FFL for coming out to, 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 to play in uh, North American Squad 71. GG's all around. Uh, so one, but I'm going to go ahead and, you know, go ahead and close this out. Well, I'm going to let Johnny close this out because, you know, he did the best thing. I got, 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 got something from him. So thank you guys for coming out. Thank you guys for coming out. Thanks for guys for tuning in. Don't forget to follow the stream. I'll be streaming a little bit more, uh, squad action, uh, probably tomorrow, today and tomorrow and Tuesday because I'm off. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and play something from Johnny that he always does at the end of every North American stream because this needs to be played. So. But we do always end North American Squad with a big, another big thank you to people that maybe were involved with the game or not. But um, we want to say special thanks to the brave men and women of the United States Armed Forces. For us, this is just a game. But for them, there are no respawns. So big thanks to Active Duty. Thank you, Active Duty. Thank you, Reserves. Thank you. And especially thank you, Veterans, for your service and your sacrifice. North American Squad salutes you. And you could salute as well in chat. You just type in an O and a 7. And then that's how you get that. Nothing but respect. My name's Johnny Omaha. This is my partner in crime, Hainik. Thanks again, Sergeant Ross. Missiles, guys. Thank you. All right, guys. Stay squatting. I miss those guys. I really miss those guys. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you guys for tuning out. Thank you guys for tuning in. And you boys just be signed out, y'all. This is y'all be easy.